Hey YouTube, what's going on out there? I'm telling you there's some excitement in the Tampa, Florida area. I don't know what it's all about. I can't figure it out. I think there's something to do with this guy named Romney and with another guy whose name is uh, Paul Ryan. I thought there was going to be a Paul in there, but not this one. I thought it would be Ron Paul, but they got Paul Ryan instead. I think they got it mixed up somehow. The Romney thing. Romney is running up against Obama, which means Obama will win. No question about it. Obama's uh, sugar daddy, also known as George Soros, owns the company that's going to count the votes. You tell me who's going to win this election coming up. You tell me if George Soros owns the company that's going to count the votes. What the point in getting excited about Romney going up in the polls? There's only one poll that matters, and that's the poll on November. The final poll, the vote. And those votes will be counted in Spain by George Soros himself. Who do you think is going to win? Anyway, I don't understand this excitement. I can't figure it out. Are these guys not aware of what's going on? Or they just want to continue in the delusion of thinking that they might have something to do with the upcoming election. You guys in America, you're a very strange group of people. You believe everything they tell you. We here in uh, Caucasian, you know, we understand these things, how they work in Caucasian. Yeah, that's it. That's where I'm from. All right, well, anyway, I think I heard somebody say that on the radio today. It was a clever statement. Caucasian Stan. Very interesting. Anyway, let me just say this. Come January 21st, 2013, who's going to be living in the White House? It's not going to be Romney. Romney will still be living uh, in his present home. And so will Obama be continuing to live in his present home on Pennsylvania Avenue. So that's it. I just wanted to let you know that I cannot understand this excitement. I can't figure it out. I don't get it. Somebody please tell me what's going on that makes people excited about this election upcoming. It would have been more exciting with Ron Paul, but this way, I don't know. Seems like it's a done deal to me. All right, well, we'll talk to you later. Thanks for watching.